so guys we're back and we're in nba 2k21 and today we're gonna be doing a reboot our first reboot i have a lot of stuff planned i saw a lot what's going on apparently there's no rookies in the game don't worry i got a workaround for that coming in the next few days however we're gonna be starting this thing off with a philadelphia 76ers reboot now for some reason i normally do this look how we can't even start the offseason though but normally i always start off with a 76 er rebuild however this was a rebuild that you guys requested i literally put up a poll you guys said that you guys wanted to see this rebuild so that's what we're gonna be doing man today's launch day i got like two videos minimum dropping maybe even three i'm gonna be experimenting with a lot of different modes so let me know what you guys want to see in the comment section below but look at this roster man joel and ben simmons uh. <laughs> Josh Richards, oh my goodness, Matisse Thibel, you know, we got a vlogger here, Shake Milton, Alec Burks, this, this team ain't it, this team ain't it, now, I can't cap, man, you guys know what's probably gonna happen, like, in real life, Joel Embiid is the guy that has to get traded, and I'm gonna explore doing that in 2K, I'm gonna explore it, I mean, why not, of course, we're gonna build a super team, but, the, like, Joel might not be on this team, you feel me, he, he just might not, I mean, I'm looking at every single option. Obviously, Ben Simmons is so much easier to like build around, but I do want to see what we can do with this. First off, let me check something, man. L let me piece something if they did actually update this game or just copy and paste it. Uh, let's we're, we're looking at tendencies. Quick little tendencies. Tatum's at 85 is actually like decent. We're gonna look at Pascal Siakam and Brandon Ingram. Bronze at 90. Cool, cool, cool. None of this stuff really matters. Jonathan Isaac says 50 is at a 55. Post at a 60. That seems a little copy and paste-ish to me, but we're going to keep it moving. Okay, B.I. is at an 85. They changed that at least. So, I know that they changed that. What about Christian Wood? 65. We'll see how much he averages this year in 85. All right, so at least they changed their tendencies because that was a major problem in 2K20. But, yeah, looking at this team, and let's find our first trade because, yeah, I do want to make this team into a super team, but it couldn't hurt if we actually get some shooters around Ben Simmons. Okay, so... Step one of getting a shooter. CJ McCullum is a really crafty player that I would like to have on this team. His three-point shot, I thought it, like, I legitimately thought it'd be a little bit higher. At the end of the day, him and Trevor Ariza is better than Tobias Harris. I'm going to go ahead and take that deal as our first deal, and we clear the highest paid player on this team. I still want to trade away Joel Embiid, but I just don't know what I'm going to get from him. Look. The game came out a minute ago. Already an update. Hopefully something to fix this game. But B.I. is there. B.I. is there. Can I do this without even trading away? Uh, Joel Embiid. Can I think you guys Al Horford. And what's... Like, we don't even got first on picks like that. What happens with him at point? He goes to an 82 at point. Because CJ can... CJ can play make. And he can do a lot of things really, really well. As a matter of fact, he has the same passing pretty much as ben simmons and before i actually forget let's make sure that we get our bowl oh, <laughs> brett brown you're out of here where is ty Lue? ty Lue is still on the clippers i'll be right back i gotta get old boy he's not in the game tyron Lue is not in the game wow y'all couldn't you guys couldn't even get that right y'all couldn't even get the head coach in the game he was literally in 2k20 let's just rock with that i don't that's jacob underwood but he, now he's our head coach all right so getting back to making some of these trades so derrick rose popped up and uh, i'm gonna take it all right <laughs> i'm gonna go ahead and i'm gonna take it next up on the list of trades that we actually need to make let's just do it now no pain no suffering who can we pick up on a, on a reasonable contract? Somebody who can preferably space the floor. Like, all these contracts are really bad. But Buddy Heald, I guess that's the best one. Him just to be our sixth man, this is easily the best deal that we can actually get. All right, and this is the lineup that we're going to be rocking with for the first season. It's going to be Derrick Rose, CJ McCollum, Matisse Thiable, Ben Simmons, and Joel Embiid. Looks like they got some new face scans, but why is theirs so drastically different than Thiable's? Theirs got sharpened, too, like a T. But off the bench, we got Buddy Heald shake milton it's kind of it's kind of mid off the bench i'm not even gonna lie to y'all it's kind of mid <laughs> like it's it, it's it's very much kind of mid i hope we have a good team but we're, we're really just gonna have to just wait and find out and just see how good this team actually is all right so the sim speed is actually still kind of slow but i gotta say it's it's a lot faster than, than 2k20 still mad slow though 
but it's better than in 2K20. At the end of this first year, we go 49 and 33, so we're still a pretty shit team. But LeBron is the MVP, 33 points, six boards, 11 assists. Some, okay, see, th this is why they, they didn't put rookies, bro. This man only averaged a half a steal in his rookie of the year. My boy Yusuf Nurkic is six man of the year. Good for him. Hassan Whiteside starting over him. Now that's cat. Giannis, defense player of the year. Christian Wood is most important. See, this is the numbers that he should be averaging. So they fixed the tendencies. I, at least I can see that. And Brad Stevens is coach of the year. We get Joel Embiid on all NBA first team. So good for him. We might actually keep him around. Now, Ben Simmons is on a defensive team. So it seems like they only work out either on 2K or just because it's Tyron Lou. Bull Bull somehow did, did not beat these guys out, which is kind of ridiculous for our rookie first team. But this season, we are the fourth seed. So we're pretty much about where Philly was in real life. Uh, that's tough. <laughs> but, you know, we're actually a decent team. Possibly with three more wins, we would have beat out the Milwaukee Bucks, which is crazy. And this team right here, the Brooklyn Nets looking pretty freaking good but as far as everything else goes let's look at the stats on this team stats wise Joel and B 25 third or 25 and 16 and two and a half blocks really really good Ben Simmons 18 points so these are honestly Ben Simmons numbers and I don't expect him to even take threes buddy he would off the bench we had a really good team like as far as scoring goes we had a lot of good pieces on this team I'm not sure if D Rose is sticking around all right, let's get into it. Round one, we got Miami. Now, Miami is one of them sleeper teams that you do not want to see in the playoffs, but we're up 2 on them, and we're up 3-0 on them. Get these boys up out of here. Let's not choke. Please don't choke, y'all. Okay, we we escaped to take on the number one seeded Boston Celtics. Now, let's see if we can beat these guys. I'd love to beat them on the road. If we can do that, that would be great. We smack them in that first game. They got no answer for Joel Embiid. Now, Jason Tatum is a monster, as we know, but we'll see. But... I also noticed that 2K added the uh, boomer bus function. I hope that happens whenever we whenever we draft players. We lost by all right, so we actually go up 2-0. But yeah, as far as the boomer bus thing, because I saw that King of the Fourth Quarter, he had that. I know that they use Zion as the example, but I think that's mainly for when for when we draft players, like newly drafted players. I don't know. Maybe I'm just completely off. But Joel and B just dominates them in this game, man. 30, 25, six, six blocks. We're up 3-0, and once again, these are my settings, man. And, like, yeah, the injuries are turned off, but the Sim is at 50. We're, we're actually running through the Eastern Conference right now. We're up 3-0. Can we get out of here? All right, come on, y'all. We're, like, we were up 3-0. Let's just not fold. We're still a better team. Come on, man. We got so many pieces. We were built. Yo, I'm about to play you guys that clip. That Kevin Love says said about Tyron Lue. It's for playoff games. Ty Lue is great. Ty Lue, it's like, okay, we were an underachieving regular season team, but when it came time for playoffs, he's like, I got this. It just made more sense moving forward when it came to playoff time. Yeah. Kevin Love said the regular season, they might not be on anything, but during the playoffs, that's when they turn it up and they start winning those games. And that's what we're doing, and it's only season number one. We got some more time left. I I'm at least doing a second season in this video. But right now, we are overachieving so much. Brooklyn beats us by six points, but Brooklyn, look at Brooklyn's team. Kyrie had 50 on our heads. Now, he better hope that he don't get that like Ben Simmons matchup, then it's going to be locks for him. But uh, we, we, we actually take the lead. Oh, my gosh. We're, we're down 0-2. I mean, it's a blessing to even make it this far, but I don't want to go out like this. Like... That's what I do not want to do. We win by one point. So right now, they're up 2-1. Let's tie up this series at home. We, we got to win the games at home, y'all. We got to get the games at home. We have to get the games at... Okay. We, we don't. We're, we're down 3-1. If we get another close game, I actually will hop in. But let's just see how this thing goes. I don't want to go out. We're, we're going out sad. There's no reason to hop in this game. We get 3-1, but it's all good, man. We made it further than I thought. That Tyron Booth still ap applies. We were mad mid in the regular season. Made it to the Eastern Conference Finals, and the Lakers won the championship. And then LeBron, that's his fourth. Triple-double. But let's head into this offseason. Let's make some moves, man. I'm definitely making some trades, going after some free agents, depending on the money that we actually have, because I think that, I think that we still broke. I mean, we got CJ, who was a great performer, but... 
we're broke. Like, we got no money at all. But let's bring all of our guys back because they are easily trade assets. I don't even know who this guy is. Wait, is this that dude? He looked like Kevin Durant last summer. Yeah, let's keep him around because he, he might be useful. But let's head into free agency. Hopefully, a veteran wants to pull up here. Like, we just got to see. This might be the move that I, I actually do. And I, and I know that this doesn't help us with shooters. But this definitely helps us get better players to, to be on that wing. Like, look at what we got. And, and I might just play CJ at point guard. It's like, CJ at point guard. Marcus Smart. Ben Simmons. And we find a power forward. And then we should be good. Because... In all honesty, this is a good move, and we save money by doing this. I'm going to make that move. That might be a bad move, but we'll see once we make it. But Marcus Smart, that is an enforcer that I would like to have on this team. So I hope this actually works out. They're both really undersized, but we'll figure it out. I could get more first-round picks from the Spurs. Which other teams are Hornets? I, I want them Hornets picks. Like, those are some good picks. Now, I do want to trade for some role players. This is, like, annoying why this game even came out. Everyone is, like, a free agent. You guys can cop Shake, shake Milton. I'm not really tripping like that. All right, he, let's not make it seem like we're getting some crazy. It's Brandon Clark. So, next year's lineup, I'm probably going to be doing something like this. CJ at point. I'm going to play Ben Simmons at small forward. He goes up to a 93 overall. So, CJ Smart, Ben Simmons, Clark, Embiid. I need a backup point guard. And just looking at player progression, CJ is already heading downwards. That's where we got to move, oh, dude. Like, we had a really good team that first year. I still think that we can do better. And if guys are just going to be regressing that fast at 30 years old, it's going to be time to move. But the one thing is, I actually kind of like that. Because the reason why is because CJ is somebody who's had so many injuries. So where him regressing is not even, like... It's not, it's not crazy to me. Like, it's not that crazy to me at all. But I do want something in return for that. But first off, let me do this. Free agents. Which free agents are actually here? That makes sense. I want Duncan Robinson. If You have no other offers, bruh. <laughs> like, so they still haven't fixed that. Where dudes are just insane. And Jordan McLaughlin wants 8 million. For, what has he done in this league to want more than some of these players? Like... And they have no job. And they, and they just won't sign on. Let's see. I don't really need Joe Harris. I'm going to be honest. I don't really need him. Uh, let's let's see if I can actually upgrade a little bit. Duncan Robinson deal. That just gives us another shooter. He's better than all of them. I actually will go ahead and take and take that deal. Because he's just, he's just a better shooter than all of them. Some of these deals are actually like really, really good. I'm going to take this. Yeah, we got to take Gilchrist. I'm not really tripping over that. This is the final season of this reboot anyways. And we got a lot. We just got a lot of moving pieces. We're not starting Michael Carter Williams. <laughs> All right. So this is going to be our lineup. It's going to be CJ McCollum, Marcus Smart, Ben Simmons, Brandon Clark, Joel Embiid. And off the bench, we got Mitchell Robinson, Matisse Thybul, Duncan Robinson, Michael Carter Williams. Balance is still going to work for us. I expect us to be a better team than we were last season. However, 2K, and 2K has us as third. It, it doesn't light up the same way it did in 20, but 2K has us as third, which is definitely not that bad. Look, I'm, I I really hope that this team figures this entire thing out. It's gonna be, it's gonna be pretty interesting to actually see. Yeah, let's just see how this team does. Let's send to the, okay, we, we beat Houston by three points. Joel Embiid is gonna always be unguardable, so hopefully at the end of this season, we do a lot better than we did in that first year. And at the end of the second season, we won 63 games as Luka puts up insane numbers. I'm telling you, I can see this happen in real life where Luka goes 37 points per game. 37, 10, and 9. Nearly a triple double on, bruh. 51% from the field, 44 from the three. But he still can't shoot free throws. That makes no sense. Bull Bull is rookie of the year because, you know, Bull Bull is, Bull Bull is Bull Bull. He's also sixth man of the year as well. Giannis, we know. Bagley was most of the play. I really hope that that happens. And our boy Ty Lu, aka Jacob Underwood, is coach of the year. Now this year, do we get anybody? D Book is on is on All NBA first team. You love to see that. Who else do we actually get here? Ben Simmons and Joel Embiid are both on the second team. We like that as well. Anything else that we need to see? We get nobody on any of the defensive teams. All right, so this guy turns into an 85. All right, 2K, 
Y'all got some explaining to do about this boomer bus. <laughs> you guys have some explaining to do. This man was a boom, like boom times five. And he went to an 82, which is already too high, to an 85. That's insane. We're clearly the number one seed. That is not, that should not surprise anybody. We were an amazing team, up by six games. As far as our stats go, we're points by Embiid. Ben Simmons took over at small forward. Similar rebounds and assists, but way more points per game. But also, he can eat a little bit more. CJ at point guard, 19, five assists. Pretty respective splits as well. Brandon Clark with 13, Mitch Robinson, great up the bench. I'm telling you, I like having Marcus Smart on this team, man. Marcus Smart is just that guy. So right number one, we got Milwaukee and Giannis. They are the eighth seed, a pretty scary eighth seed if you ask me. But clearly not scary enough because we go up four, we sweep them. We sweep Milwaukee. Wait, did Giannis leave? Okay, Giannis left. That makes sense. Cause I was like, wait. Giannis left them. Alright, so it's cool. Next up we got we got Chicago. Who's on Chicago's team now? Mike Conley. Fucking Giannis, bro. Giannis, bro. Giannis joined Chicago for no reason. But they still get knocked out. We got Brooklyn. Brooklyn beat us last year. I think that we came back with a better team, if you ask me. We're going to hop in a Simcast on this one. Let's get all the dubs at home. Let's not choke. We win by a, in pretty convincing fashion, man. Great game by Joel Embiid. Um, love to see that, man. Let's go up. Let's just sim the entire round. Can we do that? Are we allowed to? We go up. We actually beat them in six. Next up, we got San Antonio. San Antonio is back in the NBA Finals. Who do, do they got? DeJounte Murray, they picked up Michael Porter, Paul Millsap, and Drummond. I don't know how I feel about this team, but I definitely just want to see how it's looking. Okay, they're actually beating us. I I don't like I don't like this team. DeJounte Murray is now a scorer? Let me peep something real quick. DeJounte averaged 20. So 2K actually did change some of their tendencies and how they actually play. I kind of like that. Now, I don't like that they're beating us obviously but i like that the tendencies are changed up a little bit they go up to oh on us we gotta take a game man they both they won both home games we, we gotta take a game on the road like we have to all right we beat them on the road we gotta tie up this series right now guys win another road game and tie up this series 2-2 do not let them go up 3-1 we cannot let okay bruh they go up 3-1 on us now, I'm calling Cat. Let's make them blow a 3-1 lead. Let's make them blow a 3-1 lead. Come on, y'all. Let's make them blow a 3-1 lead. I have confidence in us, man. We got to start off 2K21 with a bang. We have to. With a bang. We force a game seven. With a bang, y'all. We have to. Four-point game, three minutes left. I'm hopping in, but from the looks of it, we might be able to make this team blow a 3-1 lead. And it's and it's launch night. It's my first rebuild. That's why I'm a little rusty. And we're about to beat San Antonio. I'm telling you. I'm I'm playing. I I'm playing around with y'all. I'm playing. All right, let's get it. And we got ball too. All right, this uh, I was bugging out on that camera angle. It looks so crazy. What is going on here? In at the small forward position. That's the. I was trying to find Ben Simmons. Watch out. Watch. Oh. Now look guys, I, I I do plan on having face cams later on, but it's like 12 a.m. But oh my gosh! Ben! Ben! You are you are acting like that was Devin Booker! Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! I did not know the what? 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 And he makes the free throw too? This is a different Ben Simmons, man. Off that dunk alone, he's Finals MVP. I don't care. I don't care at all. After that dunk, he's Finals MVP. I don't want to hear it. I don't want to hear it. Get, get, get that out of here. Damn it, Joel. If you could just contain Drummond. We smacked the mess out of Michael Porter Jr. All right, I do want to sim closer to the actual mark. All right, let's just play this game, man. They're up by six. Why is Ben Simmons like not in the game? 112 left in the fourth quarter. Colin passes to Embiid. Over Watch out. 
If he missed that, I was going to be pissed. Nope. How does he make that? That's cap. Come on, y'all. Come on, come on, come on. We don't have time. In everything he does. Oh, uh, let's get it. And now they four point game. Four. Run it up. Clamp up. I still don't know why Ben Simmons is not in the game. The Thank you. Oh my gosh. <sighs> what are you doing? Okay, new balance player of the game. Okay, it's, it's a little new. It's a little new. I, I did not expect this from from DeJounte Murray at all. Like, I swear, I, I did not expect this. And we, we have to foul, too. All right, so they updated Lonnie Walker's haircut like that. Dang, man. We're going to – we lost th this game. Because, like, once again, though, I don't understand why at the end of the game, the starters are just not in. To me, to me that makes no sense. Like, I feel like that is a – easy ai problem to solve the same thing with players not taking contracts like that makes zero sense at all <laughs> like i'm just saying that makes no sense thank you i mean this doesn't mean anything we already lost this game and after i knocked down these free throws we're gonna call it we're gonna call it 0 for 6 dang cj is low-key the reason why we lost this thing but we're down by four points we're gonna have, we're gonna have to follow them again and then yeah, this is over. This is over, man. Unfortunately, we were not able to win a championship with this 76ers team. But like I said, man, it was my first rebuild on NBA 2K21. Some of the things changes, and I've and I've done a rebuild it in a few weeks, if we're being honest. But anyways, guys, I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. San Antonio came out of nowhere and beat us. Like, I kind of like how that was kind of random. But looking at this final roster, Ben Simmons, Joel Embiid, Mitchell Robinson, CJ McCollum. Marcus Smart, Brandon Clark, Matisse Thybulle, Duncan Robinson, Michael Carter-Williams. I didn't know Lil' Man <laughs> was even on the team like that. And the Kevin Durant lookalike. Regardless, guys, I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you go ahead and drop a like on it. Go ahead and subscribe as well. I really appreciate all of the love and all of the support. Man, a lot more videos coming for NBA 2K21. Make sure to go ahead and drop a like, hit that subscribe button as well, and turn on post notifications. I'm going to be doing park, my team, rebuilds, and a lot more stuff, and of course the NBA videos. But other than that, check out all the videos on the screen right now, and I'll see you guys in the next one. I'm out. Peace, y'all.